Yes, I've splurged, literally splurged on this fragrance and I'm so excited to unbox it. Hey there, welcome to my channel. My name is Verity, if you are just joining me for the first time. If you are one of my lovely subscribers, big hello to you. I hope that you're really, really well. It has been a while since I've dropped this amount of money on a perfume. I'm telling you, I could not rest until I purchased this. If you wanna find out what is in this bag, keep on watching. I see a lot of people talking about Celine fragrances and I've been so curious to smell them so I dragged myself into the Celine shop to smell all the fragrances and that's a big deal for me because I don't actually enjoy going into designer shops at all like I really really would rather avoid them but nothing drives me more than my perfume obsession. So excited! So they also gave me some samples in this little bag, so I'm excited to try those as well. I am buzzing. I cannot wait to unbox this and wear it today. I'm not wearing anything because I knew I was gonna put this on today. Beautiful box. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. So this is the perfume that I purchased. Cologne Francaise. This is a woody, floral, musky fragrance and it has the most beautiful note of fig. Probably one of the best fig fragrances that I have tried. It's beautiful. Oh my goodness. I'm going to spray this on myself because I'm going to wear it today. This is one of those perfumes that fits a very clean aesthetic. It's a very, very fresh, clean, musky scent. The notes listed in this are fig tree, moss, neroli, oris and musk. Now, although I do like a lot of those notes, on paper to me, this seems like it would be a very green fragrance. And it is a green fragrance, but it's really, really well balanced with floral notes and some sweetness as well. It has a really buttery creaminess about it. And I think that is coming from the Oris. It's giving it a very buttery feeling. The Neroli note is beautiful it's so fresh and realistic this definitely would smell amazing on a man also i'm gonna get my husband to wear this this is the kind of scent that is ideal for hot weather here in dubai it's this time of year is unbearably hot it is roasting and this is that kind of fragrance that just makes you feel refreshed and it's quite cooling while still having this real creamy sweetness about it. It's a perfect all year round scent, but it's one that is perfect for this time of year. If you are living or you're going to a very, very hot and sticky and humid climate because it just has this really refreshing, cool vibe about it. Like many of the other Celine fragrances, it does have that slight powderiness, which gives it a really luxurious feel, but it's definitely not heavy powdery. It's just this little powderiness on the dry down. It's absolutely effortless, kind of works in any situation. I have so many perfumes that I adore and love, but at the moment, this is the only one I can think about, which is mad for me, like crazy. If you like white florals, if you love neroli, if you are into like fig fragrances, musky, clean, very laid back scents, you have to give this one a sniff. Celine's Cologne Francaise is absolutely stunning. This is gonna be my summer 2024 fragrance. I am 
actually in love with this. Do let me know in the comments if you have this or if you've tried it because I generally don't hear much about this perfume from Celine and I do hear a lot about some of the other ones and don't get me wrong, like they are really gorgeous as well. I smelt quite a few that I was interested in, including the new one, Zuzu. I love, love, love that. It's very obviously completely different scent profile to this. It's this gorgeous like vanilla skin kind of scent, beautiful. But this one was just one of those perfumes, as I said, that when I tried it, I knew instantly I needed to buy it. So yeah, do let me know if you've tried it or if you get to try it, let me know your thoughts on it. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you did enjoy the video. If you did, please do give me a thumbs up. And if you feel like it, please do subscribe to the channel and I will see you soon. Bye.